Hey guys, today I'm reviewing this little Rogue um, portable amp, home amp that I purchased. It is a 15 watt um, amplifier, plain amplifier, six and a half inch speaker. Um, up top simply has a uh, overdrive switch that you can engage on and off, master volume, equalizer, which is high, medium, and low to, to adjust bass and treble. And then it has a quarter-inch jack for a headphone. And that's it. It's uh, got an attractive um, tweed, you know, emulates a tweed-type uh, covering on the amplifier to look like the old um, Fender Champ, I guess. Um, so it's an attractive-looking amp. Um, but again, it's a very, very, you know, bare-bone, basic amplifier. So I'm going to put my camera back here. Excuse me one second. <laughs> there I go. It's... One-man show with uh, very little technology. Um, I apologize, but uh, so that's basically the amplifier. Um, what's the plus of the amp? The plus of the amp that it's 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 got a decent, clean sound. Um, very good sound when it's clean. It's definitely usable. When you engage the overdrive, that's where things start to 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 go downhill. Um, in my opinion, the, the distortion is horrible on this amplifier that it comes with. Um, you definitely need some sort of an external pedal uh, to get any sort of usable distortion. Um, this amp has no digital effects, so you're not going to get... Um, there's no reverb on the amp. You're not going to get any echo. Um, you're not going to get any chorus or face or any of those types of uh, effects. If you want those, though, you can simply uh, get a cheap device like this. This is a Pock Rock um, that I purchased off of Amazon. And then you can, you know, connect this to the amp, and it'll give you echo, phase, uh, reverb settings, um, different levels of distortion that are much better than that are built into that amp. So you can make it into a, uh, an amplifier, you know, that has effects, but it has to be external. Um, the amp itself doesn't come with anything other than just the basic, you know, distortion and non-distortion. And again, distorted, not very good not distorted or just clean, it's usable. It's, it's an excellent little amplifier. I like the fact that it has a six and a half inch speaker, so not like some of these flies and some of these other portable, real portable uh, battery operated amps that only come with three inch speakers. This thing actually has a speaker and a lot of people mod the amp by taking out the six and a half inch speaker and it has room for an eight inch. So people I've read in reviews have put in eight inch speakers and make this amplifier into a really usable little uh, amp. And it looks neat again with the tweed-like uh, cover on it. So um, that's the bottom line on the amp. Um, I'm going to turn it on now so you can hear what it sounds like. And I'll give you an idea of what I'm talking about in terms of the distortion not really being usable. So I'm going to turn her on. There's my guitar. Okay, so hopefully you can hear this. Um, I'll play just a, a couple of basic chords clean so you can hear how the amp sounds, okay? Engage the distortion, you'll hear what I'm talking about. So here's what the distortion engaged on the amplifier. Now I'm not sure how well this is picking up with this um, sound on 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 my um, system here, but a lot of distortion and a lot of buzzing. As soon as I engage that distortion, it when I'm playing through it, is a lot of buzzing. It just sounds horrible. Again, I'm not sure if it's coming through or not.
combination of me playing and the poor distortion, it's not a very good sound coming out of this amp with, with distortion on it. So I don't engage it at all. I just play through clean mode and it's fine. Bottom line, for when this when the amp is on sale, I definitely highly recommend it. Um, I bought it on a, a Cyber Week special. It was thirty nine ninety nine, and it's well worth thirty nine ninety nine. Normally it's sixty five or sixty four ninety nine, you know, plus tax. Then not so much. I mean, it's still not a bad price, but um, there are other options out there that you could probably get. What, again, what I like about this versus like a Fly Three or some of the other small combo amps that you can find on. Uh, Donner and some of the others that are on Amazon is that this has a six and a half inch speaker versus a three inch and that that's a good thing and the fact that you can mod it and put it in it'll house a larger speaker is a real plus for this cabinet and this amp so at $39.99 I recommend it at $65 it's a it's a coin toss um, but that's the um, Rogue V15G and uh, any questions on this little amp Please fire them below. I'll do my best to answer them as quickly as possible. Um, and again, if you find these reviews helpful, please support me by subscribing and giving me a like. And until the next time, guys, be well and stay safe. Take care.